right, y'all. So now I take y'all over to one of the hottest tattoo shops around, Tattoo Houston. I get to sit down with the owner, Mark, and who knows, maybe I got inked up, but you got to keep watching to find out. All right, y'all, so I'm posted up here at Tattoo Houston, here with the famous Mark. How are you? Somewhat. <laughs> I'm good. Yeah, I tweeted it that we're coming over here, and everybody's like, say what's up to Mark. So this is a hot spot. How long have you been here? Been here going on about three years. Wow, okay. Yeah, I've seen your place a couple times, but I never came in. I'm terrified of needles, so I don't have any tattoos, but maybe you can convince me to get one. You're going to give it one day, trust me. <laughs> so you do a lot of the tattoos yourself, right? Yeah. Okay, and it's you and your brother or your cousin? My cousin Hector. We're partners in here. Okay, so you've been here a while. What kind of people do you get coming in here to get tatted up? get all kind of people. You get everybody from suits to the hood people. Everybody, everybody want to get a tattoo. Why'd you, why'd you get a spot over here? Spring, Texas, by the way. Shout out to everybody in Spring. Well, we already had two other locations, one on Mesa and one on I-10 East and Federal. That was over there on, on the east side and northeast side. We just need to expand it out. Wanted to go somewhere where people haven't heard of us yet. So why not a little further than Houston? So you have more than, you have another location? We have two other locations. This is our third location. This is the last one we opened up. We got the one on I-10 East and Federal and Mesa Road in Tidwell. Oh, okay. All right, y'all. So make sure you hit them up. Uh, what are some of your favorite tattoo designs to do? Anything and everything. Anything from color to black and gray, whatever. So do you like doing tats on guys or women better? <laughs> <laughs> Females, of course, always. All right, do you do uh, piercings and all that too? Yeah, we do piercings also. And you got those late hours over here, huh? Yeah, we're open every day from 2 in the afternoon till 2 in the morning, Friday and Saturday till 3 in the morning. So whenever y'all get out the club and y'all ready to get hit up, we're still open. Yeah. It's a nice spot, y'all. They got a pool table in here. They got a nice sitting area. Big back area, the jamming, big old plasma, nice lounge in here. I like it. It's a cool spot. So what, what made you want to get into doing tattoos? My cousin, who's also my business partner, he's the one that got me into it. He kind of tricked me into it a long time ago. But uh, he's the one that showed me how to tattoo. I've always been able to draw a little bit. He got me into it. Never really took it serious. I did it just kind of like messing around with it. But I fell in love with it. You know, you get into this and you start getting into it. You want to get better. You see all these other artists that are real famous. So you want to step your game up. Well, I see you, but you're not covered in tattoos. How many tattoos you have? Are they all hidden? I get most of them covered. I got them all. Nah, he's scared of needles too, y'all. <laughs> Why you gotta tell everybody? Now everybody knows my secret. Y'all only see like one, two. One's on my hands, but I'm getting ready to get ready to get sleeved up. Can't let everybody be walking around with better tattoos than me. I think that's hot. By the way, I like guys. Guys are hot with sleeves. I like that. I think that's pretty hot. This <laughs> then. Where, where's your favorite spot for a girl to have a tattoo? Everywhere looks good. I mean, it depends. Every female can't rock the same thing. You know, you got to get something that matches you. So, really, just depends on the female. Do that. <laughs> All right, y'all. So, I'm still here posted up at Tattoo Houston with my boy Mark. Now, we're over here with a couple of designs here on the background. I want to know, like, how long does a typical tattoo take? Like, something like a big on the arm or leg or something? Uh, most tattoos, if it's some kind of big, maybe about an hour, uh, some bigger, like a forearm piece or something, you can look at anywhere for maybe two or three hours on those, depending on how detailed it is. Do you take breaks between that? I try not to because it takes longer when you take breaks. You know, once an artist is into it, they get into the tattoo, they kind of get in their groove. But sometimes people do want breaks. They start hurting, they want a little minute to catch their breath. What about the small ones? How long do those take? The smaller ones? If it's real small, something maybe about 10, 15 minutes, maybe 30 at the most. Those are the quicker ones. That's maybe what I would need. Those are done before <laughs> it even really starts hurting. Oh, God, yeah, I heard your skin, like, numbs up and all that, right, where you don't feel it anymore? Some people say it numbs up. They don't always numb up. I've sat there for four and a half hours straight through a tattoo, and I'm sitting there waiting for it to numb up, and it never did. I'm like, man, my customers lied to me. <laughs> I know you did uh, my boy, my producer, C's tattoo, too, right? Yeah, I tattooed him a couple of times. You know, he came, he's been coming to us ever since it was just the Mason location. Yeah, he's been a real loyal customer. He's been showing us a lot of love. Shout out to Big C's, my producer back there. I know you get a lot of people that come in and out of here. Like, what are some, you know, celebrities or local people, artists that you've hit that you've gotten to chat? I've tattooed my boy, uh, Kelly Carleon from the Boss Hog Outlaws. I've tattooed Eddie DeVille. 
tattooed a uh, stunner man. Everybody knows stunner from the mouth. Uh, tattooed coast before. Uh, tattooed another local artist that's pretty famous. Criminal from the Hater Proof camp, of course. So, you know, I've tattooed quite a few people from around here. Okay, what is uh, one of the craziest things that's happened? Because I know people try to come in here probably drunk or I don't know, so the pain will go away, but I'm sure people do some crazy things. What's the craziest thing you've seen? Oh man, people come in here drunk, high, whatever. They're just trying to get ready for the pain, but you know, it really isn't that painful once they. Has anybody ever passed out? People pass out all the time, believe it or not. A lot of people start getting lightheaded and like, oh my God, this has never happened. And, you know, does it happen all the time? But it happens a lot more than what you think. Okay, then that just totally took my courage away of getting one. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so this is one of his third locations. Uh, where can people hit you up at? Uh, you can call me at the shop, 281-251-6488. Um, I'm not here, just call, leave a message with whoever answers. They'll give me a message. Okay, now are you on Twitter yet? You need to get a Twitter. No, I'm not on Twitter yet. I've heard a lot of people tell me about that. I don't know. I'm not a real internet person. I don't know. We'll help you get that started because you definitely need a Twitter. Yeah, show me. Yeah. I, I, I posted that we're coming out here on Twitter and everybody says shout out to Mark, so... You definitely need to get one. It's good for networking and all that. So as you can see, he's got a lot of great designs back here. You guys do your own personal designs though too, right? Yeah, we do a lot of customized stuff. People come in and want something custom drawn for them that nobody has. Give everybody your address and where people can come here where we're at. We're out here in Spring, Texas at 17611 Kirkendall Road, Suite H. Um, like I said, you can get a hold of us through the phone too, 281-251-6488. All right, y'all. Well, Tattoo Houston here on the north side in Spring, Texas. Make sure you check him out. A lot of people know my boy Mark. He'll hook you up. He's about to hook me up. So, all right, y'all. Well, we're out of here. Peace. Hey, guys. I want to remind y'all to hit me up at twitter.com forward slash thatgirlala. Get any show updates, behind the scene pics, and much, much more directly from my Blackberry. Also, to check out any video clips from season one and season two, go to youtube.com forward slash lalasworldtv.